not the Yankee Stadium debut Montas would have wanted, I'm sure. What were you seeing from him tonight? Um, I think he just missed in the center of the plate with some with some heaters that got him in, in trouble. Um, you know, obviously Springer hurt him. Um, you know, missed with the, the pitch to Chapman. Um, and then the inning where they, you know, uh, hung the five spot on out there. Um, you know, he walks Merrifield. Springer, he, I, I thought he made a good pitch on him. You know, but Springer did a pretty good job with two strikes there, just getting enough of it to dump it in there. And then, a, you know, looked like a center cut fastball that he missed with Vladdy, and, and that's kind of, you know, wrecked the outing there with the three-run homer. But just some, some fastballs in the center of the plate. looked like he hung a, hung a split to uh, Teoscar. So maybe just not quite the put away, you know, with the split fastball combo that he's had. Do you think that's because he's still in the process of, of getting fully back and getting completely no, back? Out, or no, I think, I think physically, I, th I think he's in a good spot. I, I mean, yeah, we're building him to a certain point, obviously, which now he should be, you know, full starter workload. But no, I think it was just a matter of just not quite having some finish and, and you know, <clears throat> that, that really good command that you need against a lineup like that. They made him pay in the center of the plate a few times. Chris. Through his first three starts, are you at all concerned with Frankie's command? Um, no, I, I think I think physically he's in a good spot. Um, you know, I think you know going back to last last start, I thought he threw the ball well. I, actually, in in parts of today, I thought he threw the ball really well. You know, he just got hurt in the center of the plate a little bit, and maybe not you know quite the real good split that you know, we saw lat in, in Boston where he really you know, had that dive in down and out of the zone, how he wanted to, left a couple of those up. So, no, I think it's just a matter of some mistakes against a good hitting team that made him pay. Bob. Aaron, do you think it's possible just, you know, pitching for the first time in front of a stadium crowd may have affected him? Um, I mean, he hasn't struck me that way at all since, since he's gotten here. Um, you know, even in, even going into St. Louis, he didn't seem, um, it, you know, as as tough as tough and weird a situation that was coming in the night before and pitching the day game. You know, I, to me, I haven't seen any of those, you know, jitters or wanting to. It doesn't seem that way to me. Um, you know, but you know, we got to go start getting results. Obviously, uh, Brendan Marley. Why Abreu in the seventh, and what did you see from him tonight? Um, I, I don't know why Abreu. What does that mean? I just was wondering the the, the reasoning to use him. Uh, well, just you know, we're, what are we down for there? Um, you know, we're trying to stay, use our righties to kind of stay in the game against that lineup. Um, uh, you know, we had. Double play ball. Um, I think what was the first guy? Uh, would spring? Oh, Springer smoked the ball to center for the base hit. Then double play ball. We don't turn. Um, then a three-two pitch. He loses Guriel. So just not as sharp. They hit some balls hard off him, um, but was at least able to work through. Uh, you know the inning, but you know not making a play behind him. You know, you know, kind of uh, obviously cost a couple of runs. Marley. Aaron, you have played incredibly well against the AL East this season. Your record was spectacular. And now it's um, the loss to the Red Sox, then the loss to the Rays, and now this first loss. Is there a point, you know, with a single-digit lead that you start worrying about the division because of this uh, tough skid you're in right now? Um, I don't know about worry. Like, I worry about everything. I apologize for you being so, more specific. Worried about the lead in the division because you had such a big lead. No, it's, it's, this is about us playing well. If we play well, that takes care of itself. Um, you know, obviously, we haven't played well enough in the last 10 days. Um, so I think it's more just a rough patch of us not playing well. We have to play better. Uh, but I don't sit there and, you know, think about this lead or it's about us handling our business. If we do that and play the game we're capable of playing the rest of the way, we'll be in good shape. But we got to do that.